xrp.com use code cute at checkout link down below in the comments of me buying coins off this website stop gambling your money go save your money right now look at these prices <laughs> you better get them for the prices go back up 500k is below nine dollars when you use code cute at checkout all right guys we are back i just did a video on how to set up your offense with 6 AP and how to set up your defense with 6 AP. I just did a video explaining every position and why. So both of those videos are up. Go watch them. Cornerback tier list. Let's get to it. Now, Patrick Peterson is going to be A tier. He's not very good in zone. He's not very aggressive number routes. Vegas outside shade for zero. But he knows a direct upgrade over him. Where is he at? Mr. Sermon. Right here. It's also the same ability for zero. But he's more aggressive. He's taller and he tackles better. So... Make sure you get Sherman instead of him. Deion Sanders still zones routes. Amazing. Love him. Worth every coin. Go get him. You'll love him. And you'll keep him the rest of the year. He's that good. Um, Roger, nothing special. Um, he's small. Don't like him. Not aggressive at all. Same thing with Jackson. They're similar. Don't like him at all. How they play, they're just not aggressive, guys. You won't notice them. Not a fan. So... Uh, up next, Ty Law is going to be B-tier. They messed up his abilities. He has secure tackler for zero. So if you're just trying to like defend the run, you can sell him in and not have to pay an AP for him. So that's kind of nice. Jack Rabbit never liked him day one. He's small. Doesn't tackle well. He does not run people over. He gets ran over. Not a fan at all. Um, up next, Nitrate Lane's great. Block shed's good. Um, tackle's good. He gets secure tackler. So if you need uh, somebody to help against the run, He's great. He throws his sticks by himself. Really nice. Like him very much. Uh, Darius Slay is still S tier, guys. He jumps routes. He's really good. And now his price drop, he's actually worth the coins. If you haven't used him, go try him. You won't regret it. This guy's actually going to show up and make plays. AJ is just right below S tier. I'm not going to put him S tier quite. He does not tackle well. Does he play in zone well? Yes. Is he the best against jump ball? No. So, um, not S tier, but is he good? Absolutely. Now, you got Gordon, Caleb, and all these guys came from Team Diamond, right? Um, I do like Caleb as S tier. He's 6'2". He's big. He has good discounts. He's actually good. Uh, I like him way better than Gordon. So if you're wondering there, go get him over Gordon. Uh, Cromarty is still S tier. He's big. He's good. He's fast. Love him. Uh, tackles well as well. Charles Woodson's one of the best cornerbacks in the game. He has to be on your team at this point. He is that good for sure. I would say he is number three in the game. I, I would say that for sure. Rod Woodson is, man, he does. I'm going to put him, I'm going to make here. Rod Woodson, there have been so many cornerbacks came out since then. Uh, he did not play that well for me. I was not a fan of him. He tackles well. He's good against the run. Um, but man, if you get him and the other Woodson, you're going to know some night and day difference. Just please go with the other one. Now, why he's not six foot tall. Don't like that. But I will say that he gets deep out zone for KO, deep out zone KO for zero. So uh, he's going to be usable because of that. I don't like his size. In a jump ball situation, you can really get messed up with this guy. And this guy here has the same discounts as White. Uh, but. Yeah, he's not as aggressive as these guys as far as jumping routes. Uh, for surprisingly, he didn't tackle very well for me either. So keep that in mind. Um, up next. Now, this guy, I would say he's the beginning of A tier. The best of A tier. Not quite S tier. Um, he's good. There's better. Uh, I don't. They're, a lot of these guys here, their traits also are not that great, I would say. Now, and when I say that, guys, I really want you to understand. Uh, they both have good traits. Um, AJ Terrell does not have a good traits. So I think that's probably what hurts him as far as like getting uh, picks and being aggressive. But can he get a pick? Yes. Is he super consistent? No. I also mean Weatherspoon, his... Traits are also not that good. So that's why I have them farther on the list, probably what some people do, but that's going to be the, what's going to pretty much hold them back. Troy Benson is going to be S tier. I really like this card. Uh, he is big enough and um, he's a, he has good traits, good abilities. Really nothing wrong with him at all. 
Uh, Horn is going to be good in man, not really zone. He gets good man discounts. Uh, so that's your scheme. That's good. If not, I would not suggest getting him. Uh, he's definitely not as consistent as the guys in S tier for sure. So do keep that in mind. All right, guys. And Jones here uh, is too small for defending the jump ball. His best discounts are already outdated. Those cards are already beat him. He has outside shade for one. You can already get that for zero. So, uh, yeah, definitely going to be a pass. You could almost move him to B tier. Not a fan of this card at all. He has good traits, but man, is he not consistent. I, I would not get this card. Asante Samuel is still pretty solid, guys. He's usable. Um, he's going to be middle of the road almost. I would say really any of these guys are going to be better, more consistent. Uh, he is under six foot, so I don't like that. Lot Lattimore is going to be the beginning of B tier. He gets nothing good for man uh, as far as like discounts. He's not consistent. Don't like the card at all. Douglas is going to be S tier. This guy's 6'2". He's big. He has good discounts. I love him. Diggs is S tier as well. Go try Diggs if you have not. If you haven't got him yet, you should unlock him very soon. Uh, Diggs is, he, he tackles so well. Um, so that's going to do it for me, guys. Be kind for no reason. If you have any questions about any of these cards or somebody I left off the list, because I try to make the video short and to the point. Now, if you have a question for a, a cornerback that because you're running a budget team, just spam them down below and I'll I'll answer you. So uh, go watch the AP videos, guys. Often Steven 6 AP. Who should you have on your team? Both those videos are out. I'll see you very soon. Be kind for no reason. Special shout out to Justin Ashley for joining the channel. You are the GOAT. Thank you so much. Hey guys, if you want to be in every single video, join the channel. As long as you're joined, you're going to be in every video forever. I want to make a wall of fame. I want to have everybody's name. Thank you for the support, guys. Hitting the like button and subscribing. All that really does help to keep the 21 videos a week coming. Three videos every single day. So if you guys enjoy it, let me know. And... Thank you, Justin, for supporting the channel. Behind Fun Reasons Reason has always been the message since day one I started this channel. It's always going to be the message. And Justin, you have a good day.